Body Workout Live. Happy Friday! You made that this far this week? Congrats! It's another Friday. It's another beautiful day to just show up for yourself. So, hi, welcome, welcome, welcome. Let's get it started. God, for you, if you're new following me, welcome. My name is Grace Levine and I am a health coach. Besides posting a lot of content about health and nutrition, lifestyle, health lifestyle, habits, and everything between, I also do an Instagram live every Friday at 7 a.m. Okay? It's usually a full body workout with no equipment, something that you can do at home. And it's really like a beginner workout, so anybody can do it. This is mostly for beginners, okay? Full body workout, no weights. And um, it's usually like a quick workout, but sometimes it takes between uh, 40 minutes or 45 minutes because I'm always showing everything I'm doing. So that's it. We are going to start uh, in like a minute. Let me lower this. Down. So yeah, I have been getting a lot of new followers. So welcome, and I hope you enjoy my content. I also post this video on YouTube and Facebook, so you can always go to my YouTube channel, Grace Feet or my Facebook account, Grace Fit. I post the same video that I'm posting on Instagram today, tomorrow, okay? I always post my workout, my live workout video next day on YouTube and Facebook, okay? So, welcome. Hi, Deandre. Coming to my TRX tonight. Yes, I'm gonna try to go tonight. Love TRX, so good. Hi everyone, Milena, Christina, Navy Sailor, okay, welcome everybody, I also have like a very exciting new something, you know like I, I am a health coach but you know I also love the exercising side of a healthy lifestyle. So I started studying to get my personal trainer license this week. So yeah, so soon I'm also gonna be a certified personal trainer. And that's just gonna be more knowledge and I'm very excited to put together the nutrition and the exercise science together. So I can add more value to you, to my clients, to everybody. So, this is what's new with me. Uh, in a couple of months, I'm gonna be certified as a personal trainer as well. So lots of great stuff coming, guys. All right, so let's start. Let's start warming up. The workout today is kind of like the same structure that I have been using for the past Fridays. Uh, I'm doing six uh, exercises and they're divided by three parts. So we're gonna do everything for part one three times. Then we're gonna do everything for part two three times. And then we're, gonna, we're going to do everything for part three three times as well, okay? And if you're wondering why I'm doing these uh, Instagram lives every single Friday, it's just to invite you to get moving, okay? Just to do something uh, so you have no excuse. You can just try one of these workouts, see if you like, how, see how you feel about yourself, and keep going, keep moving, set up a goal to move for 15 minutes every three days if you can, and that's how you start, really. There's no like a magic way to start. You just start with big steps, to stay consistent with your big steps, and that's how you progress. Okay, so let's just do a quick warm up. So the block is ready to go. Alright, this is gonna be like two, three minutes warm up. I am just gonna, I always like to 
like stretch of my arms before doing any workouts just because seven o'clock, right? And I'm sure everybody just got up. Remember 
one important thing, okay? The most important thing is breathing, okay? So make sure when you feel tired, you take a deep breath, okay? So in, inhale with your nose and exhale, okay, with your mouth. So always when you're tired, when you feel like it's so hard, you don't have air, just remember to breathe, okay? This is the most important thing. Sometimes people just keep holding their breath. It's like not doing nothing for you. So you need to breathe. That's how you get through like running, any yoga, like any workout, any exercise, even walking, just breathe. Even when you're stressed, just like remember to breathe, okay? That's my biggest helper. It's really like breathing, like air. You need air, okay? So that's the team. Alright, so part one of this uh, workout is going to be chest opener. The first the first exercise. So it's 40. We're doing 40, okay? So it's just you're gonna be here and you're as you jump, you're opening your chest. Okay, so hold like that around here, and then you will open. Okay, so this is the chest opener. Keep the tension in your legs, engage your core, and breathe. Okay, most important. So, one, two, three. Keep breathing when you're doing, okay? That's one. And then the next one after that is going to be plank jacks. So you get down on a plank position. When you get down on a plank position, you want to always make sure this is straight. So you see if they are in the same direction, the arms, elbows, shoulders, everything. So find a good plank position here. Keep the core. So put some engagements here in your core. And then you do the opener. Okay, so one, two. If you cannot do that, just open. Side to side. Okay? I'm gonna count forty. So this is part one of this workout. We're going to do everything three times and then we're gonna move on to the exit uh, workout the uh, part two of the workout. Okay, let's go. I'm just gonna start my Apple Watch very quick. Alright, we're going. 40 chest opener. Ready? One, two, three. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 
good thing you're gonna have two feet. Okay. And then we're doing long jump, long jump shuffle. And we're doing 15 of those, okay? So what is it? You jump, and then squat, come back. Okay, you can you can come back like normal, like walk, or you can stay down if you want to be pushing yourself extra. Okay, so you just jump here and walk back. You can walk back normal if you're super beginner. Just walk back normally. Okay, because the legs are gonna be so tired. Just start slow. Okay, and then the next one is going to be 15 of those. And after that, we're doing down dog to a spider lunge. Okay, I love this one because it feels so good for the whole body. So, I love this one. You're basically here. Okay, so you bring your feet here. Okay, and then you come back. And one more. Come back. This is so good. But engage your abs to engage everything down here, okay, while you're doing that. Alright, so one, two, okay. This is what we're going to be doing. So we are, again, we're doing three sets off. 15. 15 long jump shuffle and then 15 down dog to spider lunge. All right, ready? Let's do it. Just 15 of each three times. All right, it should be fun. Let's go. I'm committed to music.
or you can just do whatever and then you get nowhere, right? So think, okay? One, two, do it slow but feel like the movement, all right? That's it, quality. So we're gonna start part three, let's do it. Okay. Bye. 
That's it, you can see it. And uh, I really don't have all the calories, but the calories for next total is 176 calories total. That's it, we're done. This is the <laughs> sorry, the music was so loud. This is exactly the goal of this exercise to bring your heart uh, beat up, and then as you slow down a little bit, it comes down, it goes back up, and comes down and goes. Oh my gosh, I'm sweating so much. It goes back up. So that's exactly the goal. Uh, I I wouldn't say this is something you have to do every day. But if you're looking to burn body fat, this is a great exercise that you can uh, include to your week. You know, three times a week, you do these crazy moves, but you really like get to your limits and you're done. And you just eat well during the day, right? Because as I like to say, Exercise is more like to shape your body, to help you with stress, to help you with anxiety, to help you tone your body, to help you shape your body. That's what the workouts for. The exercise, right? It burns calories, that's beautiful, but there's so much more benefits besides the calories that you're burning. So that's why I tell my clients all the time and even like on my coaching group right now because most of the people don't like to exercise don't have the motivation to exercise hate to do an exercise or don't have the time to exercise right so no time no motivation no energy and no time right so i'll and then i tell them like a lot of the reasons why the many of the reasons why you don't want to exercise. You don't have the energy to exercise. You can't find time to exercise, even though you can, right? If you're watching TV one hour a day or wasting time on Instagram 30 minutes a day, yes, you have the time. It's just that exercise in the moment is not a priority for you. So what do you do is, what do I do with my clients? I talk to them, look, let's just, folks on your eating right now so we work on everything that's going on with the nutrition that's what my coaching program is about is about learning how to eat for life so you can still have your wine on the weekends if you follow my method you can still have your wine on the weekend Give me some like if you want to lose weight, be fit, and you still like have your glass of wine on Saturday, have your beer on Sunday, you know, like eat the things that you love. You still can do that. That's exactly what I teach on my method. Learn how to lose weight eating everything you love. You're still eating everything. And I teach you that there. I teach you how to combine the foods how to make the right choices, even when you're out, even when you're on vacation, even when it's a birthday, a holiday, whatever. I teach exactly that, how to make the right choices, home or out. How to combine the foods to work together for you, right? So you can still have the beer, still have the wine on the weekend, but I also teach you what to do after, you see? So once you learn all that, the exercise becomes easier. Believe me, guys, you gotta believe me. The exercise is like, oh, okay, this is the easiest thing I can do because once you fix, you fix everything with your nutrition, then you have more energy, then you have more uh, motivation to exercise, you have motivation to push yourself, to challenge yourself, 
You want to be active because you feel good, you're sleeping well, you're feeling good. And you see that you don't need to kill yourself exercising to lose the weight. If you focus on the nutrition, the way I teach, exactly the way I teach my clients, the exercise is just something that you decide you want to do because you're already looking good in your dress and now you're like, Okay, I think I want to go to my exercise and get on it because now I know how to eat, right? And that's why I say, this exercise here is for your mind. It's for you to like feel good during the day, have a good mood, you know, like negative is going to come, but you're going to be in this good mood after the workout. And you look good as well. That's just, just a bonus, right? The looks is just a bonus. And that's why I tell my clients, like, I'm telling you, if you do that, the exercise is going to be like, okay, this is fun, something I'm doing so I can face my day, everything I have to deal with. That's the mentality. And when you're doing the exercise, another thing that you need to start telling yourself is, I love this. This is awesome. This is good for me. Like, the whole time you need to be talking to yourself, every single time you exercise, if you don't like it. Because then, like, you know, like, your mind, your gut, everything is connected, right? So your body is always listening to your thoughts. As you do anything that's good for you, you need to be talking to yourself and saying, okay, this is good for me. I love this. I love how I feel about this. I love how I'm going to look after this. And, and you start to believe on that, and then you don't complain anymore, and then you just love the whole thing. You just love the whole process. Okay, so that's my tip for today. Exercise is good. Good for your health, for your heart, for your skin, for your brain, for your body, for your skin, for everything. Okay, but drink a lot of water during the day and focus on nutrition. Okay, and keep following me because I'm recording some of my classes right now, doing everything that I have to do for this group. And I'm going to open another group soon. So if you want to be part of the next group, stay tuned, okay? Keep doing what you can. Drink lots of water. Stay happy. Stay healthy. And thanks for joining me, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. Let me read the comments. Thanks, everybody, for joining. Hope you have a beautiful day. And, yeah, and I will see you soon. All right? Have a beautiful weekend, guys. Bye.